I just want to know how tough is the beef between people from Louisiana and Dolphins that would lead to y'all having a shootout. Now shout out to KALB, a local affiliate out of Louisiana, because they're covering a story about how a dolphin washed up ashore riddled in bullets. Now the story comes from Cameron Parrish, and it says that federal officials are offering a $20,000 reward for information leading to the conviction of who shot that dolphin. I just want to know how you got that much smoke for a dolphin. And more than likely, it was fishermen. It was probably fishermen. But I feel in my head it was some smoke for this dolphin, for sure. Now according to the National Oceanic Atmospheric Administration Fishery Services, because that's a mouthful, stated that on March 13th, in the Cameron Parish, a bottom-nosed dolphin had been reported on the West May Beach. Now, the reason it's a crime, not because you don't shoot a dolphin, but because under the Marine Mammal Protection Act, it's actually a crime to hunt, um, harass, capture, or kill dolphins or any marine animals that you know of. Violators do face up to $100,000 in fine and up to a one year in jail. But the fishery or the NOAA fisheries is offering a $20,000 reward. So if you know who had the smoke for that dolphin, you better call now because that's a pretty sizable reward to pass up. Now I know the dolphins have a really bad reputation across the ocean, but he didn't have to go out like this.